Right, let me talk about batting confidence. Because when you're batting, if you're not confident, the bowler's already winning the, uh, the contest. You've got to go out there 100% confident in terms of how you're batting. When you've got 100, the previous game, you walk out there, you walk in tall, anybody can come and bowl. And that's what batting's about. Now you'll practice. Don't go and practice in, uh, in nets or wherever where the pitch is bad. Because if the pitch is bad and you play and you practice in there, you now get some impossible balls to face. You then start doubting your ability to play it. Your confidence takes a knock. You're not, you're not able to time the ball properly because the ball's turning here or it's jumping up or it's shooting along on the ground. Don't go and practice in those conditions. You practice where it's good and you can get confidence and that confidence has to go into the next game. That's what you're practicing for. So make sure the nets haven't got a hole in them. When you have a look at these nets around me now, that nice nets, the ball's not going all over the place. You're not uh, trying to find it or go and fetch it all over the place. The ball's coming through consistently and I can practice my shots and all these tips that I'm giving you, I can practice the tips on that basis. And that's why when you go and practice in nets, make sure you're working on your head. That's what you're doing. You're playing in good conditions.